Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As of right now, I have no power. Lies, I kind of have power because we're using our generator. So, I couldn't think of anything else better to do than to film my Summerween TBR and the books I will be trying to get to in the month of August. So, I guess I'm going to try and go through my August books I want to get to. So, I'm going to be reading, just getting more through The Vampire Lestat, and I'm going to lose my bookmark. And I just started The Ballad of Somber Snakes because, you know, I have no power, and I was like, <laughs> I'm going to start it. So I'm going to try and get to this, too. So, and I also would like to get to Harry Potter in order to order the Phoenix because I'm slowly doing my reread of the Harry Potter books. So I'm going to try and get to this this month as well. And I'll be getting into my summer ween TBR. This is a readathon that is celebrating Halloween during the summer times, hence summer ween. And this was created by Olivia from Olivia Reads a Latte and Gabby from Gabby Reads. And they just started this because they thought it'd be cool. And I'm like, well, I love Olivia Reads a Latte and I'm just not getting into Gabby, Gabby Reads. So I thought, you know, why not? I'll participate in it. I love Halloween as well. And I will talk to you about the prompts for that. And um, challenge number one is read a book that has a creepy cover on it. And for this, I'm going to go for one of the short stories in Stephen King's If It Bleeds. Because I've read the first two short stories, but I'm like, I want to. I didn't want to read it all in one setting. So I'm getting through the short stories and I'm going to read the next one after The Life of Chuck. And read a book with a paranormal sets slash supernatural element in it. And this I'm going to go for The Shining since it does have a little bit of supernatural stuff in it. So I'm going to go for that for that prompt. Prompt number three is read a book that has a haunted house in it. And technically in The Shining there's a haunted hotel. So I'm going to go for that for the haunted house portion of it. So I'm going to go for this as well because um, I don't want to like overload myself during this readathon because I did do that during the reading rush and I kind of got a little burned out on doing that trying to cram it all in. So I'm going to try and kind of section each off, each of the pages off and kind of slowly make my way through it, not just cram it all in. And the third prompt, no, the fourth prompt is read a book in the dark. And I may read something that's on my Kindle. Maybe some sort of short book on my TBR somewhere, maybe an audiobook or whatever, but I may listen to the short story in this, depending on how long it is, which I don't think it's that long, to be honest. Let let us check this. Oh, so it's the story If It Bleeds. Okay. Alright, If It Bleeds is about like that thick, so I may listen to that or something. I don't know. We'll figure that out. So you'll just have to wait and see. And the fifth one is read a book that's recommended by the hosts. And luckily, The Shining was recommended by Gabby from Gabby Reads. So I will be reading this. So that is just about it for my tentative August TBR and my Summerween TBR. And I'm glad that I, I'm glad that, you know, I picked like two books because um, Gabby from Gabby Reads is the same thing, so it makes me feel a little, a little less bad that I'm not reading more books in the readathon. So, that's about it. Um, thank you for s just sitting here with me on my bedroom floor while the power's out. Because as you guys know, there was a storm that came in. If you watched my reading vlog, there was a storm that came in. It came in last night around midnight. And I'm also vlogging during this week too. So you'll be hearing this again, and I'm glad that you guys sat down with me with no power in my room, so I hope you guys are having a great morning, day, evening, or night to wherever you guys are at in the world, and I hope you guys have a great day, so bye!